So Chris, congratulations. We've just signed a new deal to Ryan here at Medeski Stadium for, for the next three years until 2020. I'm sure you're very pleased. Yeah, pleased. I mean, obviously I was coming into the last 12 months of my deal, so it's nice to, to get it done quite early. I think as a player, you never want to be going into into a season and, and thinking, you know, what's going to happen at the end of, of that one, um, which has been the case in the past at times. So now I'm really pleased. So big thanks to, to the club, to Brian, um, the manager and obviously the owners. So yeah, really pleased. You took on a role of captain for periods of last season when Mac was injured. Uh, you've got 200 appearances, over 200 appearances as a Royal. And even though you're still only 27, you must feel like you're one of the more senior players in the dressing room now. Yeah, you, I don't think you ever want to admit you're a senior player because I think that's half the thing of, of saying you're, you're getting older but no yeah for sure I've been at the club <clears throat> a long time now I think you know obviously along with G we signed together we, you know we're probably the longest serving players now um, and yeah obviously got to quite a, a lot of appearances over that time and, and feel really settled so um, I think for a club it's important to have people around that, that know the place and um, the people that want to be at the club and that's certainly the case with myself so yeah, really pleased. Um, I think it's a good deal for, for the club and for myself and hopefully um, you know, this season can be just as good as last but with a different ending. You and a number of other players spoke about the positive influence that the manager has had in his first year at the club, so I'm sure he was a big factor in you signing the deal. Yeah, huge. Um, I mean, I think in football these days sometimes you you because of the, the way the, the game is now managers seem to, to change quite regularly um, so that you know you can't base your whole decision on on just the manager I mean I am settled at the club and I have been before before he came but in the last year you know things have changed around the club um, and that's purely down to him and and, and his staff um, and and he is he's a big reason why it was it was an easy decision to stay um, what he's done for this club in, in 12 months is it's hard to put into words really I think if you're behind the scenes and you know what it was like when he first came um, yeah it, he's made he's made a massive impact and, and as a player he's somebody you want to play for and, and the respect I have for him is you know it couldn't be any more so yeah a big part and, and looking forward like I say to to what it was like last season and hopefully go one step further. Having spoken with Gareth McCleary earlier he's adamant that having signed a three-year contract himself that he played a big role in you staying here is, is there any truth in that? Um, yeah, if he said that then we'll, we'll let him have it um, no like, I mean I've played with Gino for I think it's eight or nine years so yeah we've um, we've seen a lot together um, and yeah obviously he signed last season and uh, other than when we we first joined it's probably it's probably the first time since that we've sort of had the same length of contract so yeah hopefully like I say that we're together now for for at least another three years and, and, and we can have a, another successful period. Um, he's not the only reason I'm staying, um, like when he signed. Um, but if he said he got me the contract, then uh, then yeah, he's uh, he can take the credit if he wants to. 